Congrats, we've saved the best for last on the college gridiron as Virginia Tech and Florida State will round out week one tomorrow night in Tallahassee. And that's where we find the rest of the 10 sports team. John Apicello and Alyssa Ray, a dynamic duo that's always drawn up the perfect X's and O's. <laughs> Guys, how's it going down in the Sunshine State? All right, Eric, we're okay. We survived a severe thunderstorm, and we're here to tell you the Hokies and the Seminoles have not met since 2012. So this is Coach Justin Fuente's first go-around with a perennial power in the ACC. Yeah, he's going into his third season at the helm of the Hokies, but it feels like just yesterday that he was hired. So we had an opportunity to sit down with his wife, Jenny, and their three girls about how they're getting acquainted to Blacksburg. Fantastic. Excited to be here. Um, I didn't know they'd be rolling out the carpet for us, but that's awfully nice. Nearly three years ago, Blacksburg's new first family touched down in Southwest Virginia. Tech fans immediately fell in love with the Fuente family. The welcome was great. Hokie fans um, showing us love and we were excited to be here and knowing that it was a football school was a pretty neat experience too. Well, there were a lot of reasons. Some of them had to do with football. Some of them had, were personal reasons in terms of getting a chance to live in a town like Blacksburg and raise my girls here. Entering his third season at the helm of the Virginia Tech program, Coach Fuente has led the Hokies to two bowl bound seasons. Win or lose, the Fuentes, including wife Jenny, daughters Cecilia, Caroline and Charlotte, are his biggest fans. They too have adapted to Blacksburg, including embracing the maroon and orange. At first I thought, how do you put those together? And then we went to a basketball game right when we first got here, and I thought, well, everybody in Blacksburg wears it. You're, you're crazy if you're not wearing it. It's in all the stores, so it just seems okay. Success on the field, check. Dress like a proper hokey, check. The Fuentes have certainly become a vital part of the Blacksburg family. So I asked Jenny if the Fuente family got to come down and watch the game tomorrow night. Unfortunately, the girls have school on Tuesday. Yeah. They will not be here, but Jenny will get to come down and support her husband and the Hokies tomorrow night. Outstanding. Well, a whole lot more of that coming. Countdown to kickoff, 7 to 8 p.m. Monday night. And it's not just Alyssa and I and Eric. Lindsay Ward is here. She has been busy on the Hokie beat mm -hmm. for weeks now, tracking down some Virginia Tech traditions. Absolutely. And we start with a tradition uh, that mixes the core of cadets and football we take a look at one of the core members who traveled down here to Tallahassee with the team today solely to take care of the American state and spirit flags and we take a look at that tradition started by coach Beamer back in 2009 at a time when football and the flag are pretty controversial topics so stay tuned tomorrow uh, they absolutely are and we've got a whole lot more it's an hour you'll have it all here so tune in seven to eight countdown to kick off we'll see you then all right, thank you so much, guys. We'll be sure to tune in for that coming up tomorrow on Labor Day.